Hello and welcome to The Rambling Peach. I hope you enjoy this video. Please like, subscribe, and leave me a comment. Thanks guys! Hey guys, today I am trying to get this whole chicken tractor straightened up a little bit. It has been up on the hill for quite a while, so it needs a lot of repairs. The bottom has got some tears in it. Um, the sides too. I also need to put some latches on the back and fix the door inside to where it'll stay open. Anyway, it's a lot of things to get done, so let's get started. Okay, right here I have it flipped up on the side so that I can put a new piece of chicken wire on the bottom in the back. Um, I always fill it with hay for the tiny baby chicks, and that way I don't have to worry about something crawling up underneath it back there where the wheels are. So here we go. Okay, right here I am just uh, knocking down the old staples that were holding this and dragging off any old grasses and weeds that are around the bottom of it there on each side. Um, this old chicken tractor was built for babies to be put in when they would first hatch from the incubator after they got, you know, a couple of weeks old and I could put them out. That way I could cover it every night and they could be in the hay in the bottom or up in the top. Okay, right here I am checking to make sure that I've got every bit of this bottom laced up good and going to hold so nothing will be able to get in here to attack the little baby chicks with the mom. There's only three of them in this little batch. I'm knocking more staples in. This wood has swelled and shrunk and swelled and shrunk from the heat and the rain. So I want to make sure everything is in here good before I put these critters in here.
right here I'm repairing yet another tear there's three or four of these little uh, pieces that the wire is broken on so I'm just pulling it together since there's so much slack in it anyway and lace them up right there Okay, guys, I put some little board latches here so that I can open this up. I've got some hay here. I'm going to drop it down. Put some fresh hay in here for these babies. So that they'll be warm tonight because it's supposed to get right chilly here. Tonight. Okay. There you go, Mama. And. I've covered it up with this extra piece of plastic because it's supposed to get right cold tonight. Down in the low 30s or 30 or below. And then I put a little catch up there. The little, uh, see if I can get it open here. See if I can show you what I'm talking about. Right up there at the top. Put a little catch so that I can hold that up. They got their food and water in here. They're in, they're loaded. And they're doing great, guys. So I guess the old track chicken tractor lives again. Help it if I had everything stabilized. <laughs> okay, so we got it done. Thank you guys for watching me as I did this little repair. Took longer than I expected, but that's the way it goes with everything when you're around the farm. Sun's come out bright today, but it's supposed to get right darn cold tonight. And I was hoping that my poor pear would uh, go ahead and get its plumes over with and this peach too because if it gets down as cold as they're saying, we're going to lose all these blooms. But anyway, that's a fact of life around here. Hello, Laurel. How are you, darling? You're just checking things out. You're so sweet and regal. You're Crooked Toes Woman, aren't you? Huh? Are you Crooked Toes Woman? What are you doing over there? What are you doing eating my my hay, little girl? What are you doing? This hay is not for you. <laughs> anyway. Alright, guys. I'm going to let y'all go. Bye-bye, and thanks for watching.